Hello! <laughs> Magandang hapon guys, today I arrived at Philippines after two hours flight from Taiwan and now we will go on a special trip. Today we will going to a special trip, we will going to Mindoro in Philippines. That's a nice island with nice beaches and more. So our trip starts here at Imus Kavit. From there we will drive with a car to Patangas and then from Patangas we will go with a ship to Mindoro. But you can hear maybe my voice is a little bit hoarse, I don't know, maybe because of Taiwan, because it was so cold or the air, airplane or airport, it was all so cold there. But yeah, like a trip to Mindoro. Our journey begins here at Imus Kavit. We will drive with a car from Imus Kavit to Patangas and from there, from Patangas, we will drive with a, with a ship to Mindoro. Yeah, my luggage is already ready, so now let's go to Mindoro. From Manila to Patangasaba, you need around two hours. There are many different ways how you can go there. For example, you can go there with a bus or a grab from Manila to the port Patangas. When you are in Patangas, Harbor, then you need another two hours around that to drive from Patangas port to Mindoro Island. There's also a port you need also around two hours. But it, it also depends on which ship you will drive to the island because there are many different ships. Some are faster and the other one are slower. But it's around two hours to drive. And also the two hours from Manila to Patangas Harbor, it also depends on how much traffic is here in Philippines because mostly there's traffic all the time here. That's crazy. There's so much traffic. So it really depends how much traffic is. Maybe you need longer or not so long. It depends on the traffic. To be exact, we will drive to the ship from Minduro Harbor to the Puerto Galera Harbor. The distance from Manila to Patanga Saba and then from Patanga Saba to Mindoro Islands to Puerto Galera Haba is around 120 kilometers. And the ticket for the bus and the ship is around 30 dollars. But it also can be a little more or a little less, it depends also. Mindoro have beautiful beaches and a lot more beautiful nature and a lot more to discover. So I'm really excited for that. So now let's start our journey. Now you see guys, now we arrived, I'm already so excited for that, so now we go to the port. But we must here wait 3 hours, so because we must here wait 3 hours here, so I would say let's go to the market, there's a market nearby, with a lot of street food, so we will go there now. How much can we do spring, this, spring rolls? How much five. spring rolls? Five, five, five. Five, everything five. Okay. So this I will... I will try to uh, spring rolls. One. Uh, two. Two. Salamat. Okay. okay, now let's try spring roll. Masarap yan. <laughs> Masarap to. Masarap to. <laughs> <laughs> Masarap. 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 Masarap.
I was wrong with the timing, so now we must go back already. It was not 3 hours, it was just 30 minutes to wait, so now we will go back. I wanna film more content, but I don't have any time now. You have seen the market outside now, let's take a look around inside the port. Here guys, here you can see the ticket encounter, here can the people get a ticket for many different islands and more in Philippines, for example Takiklan and more. Here are the different gates, each gate drives to different islands in the Philippines and we also waiting for our ship. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but on the big screen there's the different departure times for the ships when they come and go. Now our ship is ready, so now let's go to Mindoro. Now I am at the hotel, the trip was so tiring, so I will go sleep now, but at the next vlog we will go to island hopping, we will discover many different islands, have great conversation with the locals there and a lot more, stay tuned, bye!